My name is Ada Pulini Brown, and I teach painting and life drawing. My name is Robert Miller, and I teach gallery display and design. Watching those students grow is the most exciting thing I can do. To help them get serious about the discipline of making art, and to show them that the possibility of being a creative person and making a living is really there. This is my last semester here at Rio Hondo College. The professors, the teachers, the faculty, they are amazing, they're passionate. I've gone through ceramics, photography, drawing, painting. You kind of find out what your medium is. They help you develop your own style here. Education is about polishing yourself and finishing yourself and making yourself marketable. And then an art education is also building the skills that you need to be good at your field. Yeah, people can do it without going to school but it's a much tougher path. You also create a network and a family in a sense. Our teachers make sure that we have real good materials. So like the ceramics department, they have great kilns. They, have, they always have um, all the glazes you need. They always uh, make sure that you get the best paints and best supplies. So really the facilities here are pretty good. We, we have it good here at Rio. There is a faculty that's very dedicated. They're all professional artists, and they all have a lot of life experience in the arts. They have connections all over Los Angeles with like artists and museums. So when you get to know your professors here, you really get to know what the art scene is out there. They know their subject, they know their medium. A lot of students get lost at a lot of colleges. Here we have a wonderful counseling group, we have a wonderful curriculum plan, and the students can move through at a comfortable pace. And then from here, they we have a great transfer rate. I just finished applying to Cal State Long Beach, Cal State LA, and Cal State Fullerton, and hopefully I'll hear from one of them soon. And I plan to get my bachelor's, my master's, and my PhD. The students who have gotten studio art degrees, they've transferred to CalArts, Otis, uh, Cal State Fullerton, UCLA, USC, so they've gone to a couple really good schools. All the faculty in our division have relationships with other schools, and those relationships with those art departments help students know that they're taking the right classes to go where they need to go, and that those classes will articulate and transfer, and that the skills they develop here will take them into these other four-year schools and make it simpler and easier for them to learn what they need to learn. Career-wise, uh, I would love to um, work in a museum, help curate art, um, art exhibits. I would love to help um, get art pieces for the museum. The arts, especially in Southern California, are booming. We have successful students that went on to be art historians. We mm -hmm. have students that went on to be graphic designers. We have students that have gone on into the film business, students that have gone on and just shown their work in art galleries. If you're interested in studio arts and would like to transfer to a four-year university, consider earning your Associates in Arts in Art Studio Arts for transfer from Rio Hondo College. The Associates in Studio Arts transfer degree is intended to meet the lower division requirements for studio arts majors or similar majors at a CSU campus that offers a studio arts baccalaureate degree. Students who earn this degree demonstrate knowledge and skill in areas including drawing, painting, ceramics, or photography. Foundational skills and knowledge of the studio arts are the springboard for an array of careers, including professional artists, illustrator, layout artist, graphic designer, animator, advertising artist, art director, art critic, art educator, art therapist, gallery and museum curator, gallery assistant, and art restorer. The fundamental building blocks of all art studio courses are to instill skills in divergent thinking, creative problem solving, critical thinking, and creativity. If you're interested in studio arts, begin by taking a beginning studio arts course. I recommend taking either Art 120, Two Dimensional Design, or Art 130, Freehand Drawing 1. More importantly, meet with a counselor on a regular basis to make sure you're on track to meet the degree requirements.